Sadness and outrage today after a rescued dog is killed. Now the hunt is on for the person who stole that animal from a shelter in Camarillo. KCAL 9's Amy Johnson shows a security video of the canine theft. Security cameras captured someone breaking into Paul Works, an animal rescue in Camarillo. You could see the hooded person trying to get one dog out of a kennel, then moves on to another cage in the corner where Pretty Girl, a four-year-old German Shepherd was, and then the person dragged her out. She's pulling back at the kennel, she's trying to get away, and they were able to grab her by a collar she was wearing, and that's how they pulled her out. And she immediately, we call it the crocodile roll, she starts rolling her body as hard as she can to try to get away. And then she turns and starts, looks like she's biting at their forearm. That's when you see them take their phone and start hitting her repeatedly over the head with it. Brittany Viscara is a manager at the rescue that has saved about 13,000 dogs, only to have this one stolen and then the worst. When we got her, she, uh, she couldn't walk and she was at no control of her bowel movements. And I, um, she was laying on the gurney and they, I just said her name and she looked up and she just put her head in my hand. Pretty Girl was found along Highway 101 about six miles from Paul Works. She had been hit by a car. Sustained no broken bones, but she had significant road rash and severe internal trauma and trauma to her organs. Pretty Girl couldn't be saved. Her shock was so severe that her body couldn't help, it couldn't contain itself anymore and she um, crashed and passed away. Paul Works takes in dogs from shelters who were scheduled to be euthanized. They saved Pretty Girl, only to have her die so tragically. We like to believe that she gave them hell and she fought hard and she got out of that car any way she could. Donations are coming in and Paul Works has an $8,000 reward for information leading to the person who took Pretty Girl. If you have any information, call the Camarillo Police Department. Amy Johnson, KCAL 9 News.